Zuzi Bird, and welcome back to Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. In the last episode, we finished Autumn Heights, um, at least our first go through, we defeated the boss and unlocked Bright Savannah, but today we're moving our way back to Autumn Heights because we still need the 100% it. Uh, lots of stuff to do, really. Uh, we're gonna go back to the very, very first level because that is where I have missed, I think, just one puzzle piece, or just a couple of them. And then I have like a secret exit to find on 2-2, and then like tons of other stuff. So all the secret exits we have yet to find, I am missing at least one puzzle piece. So let's get started with that. I will also get Squawk so it doesn't take forever, just because I actually have no clue where this one is. Some of them, like, I have a clue, but this one, not so much. So let's get started. I am excited. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm good to go. I've been actually really enjoying this game. I've been eager to play it since I stopped my previous recording session. Oh, I like how this cutscene happens every time. This is this area at times really does remind me of like Crash Bandicoot. Okay, so did we ever get this one? I feel like we messed it up. Or maybe we didn't, I can't remember. Uh, it might be worth doing again then. I mean, I'm very, very close to 100 lives, so doing it might just get me some extra lives at least. Wait, that didn't, what, really? <laughs> That's baloney. All right, well, I don't think it's, that big of a deal, because I'm pretty sure we did it. And, and Squawks isn't freaking out about it, which I'm pretty sure he would, even if it was like in its own separate room, because uh, he's done that in the past. Wait, wait, he's really excited already. You talking about this? No? Oh, um, what is that? Bananas. Okay, he's really freaking out. Uh, I got those. Did I run out of time to do something here because he's not freaking out anymore? No, he's freaking out. Oh, I didn't see these. Okay, so I got all the, okay, cool. And that was our final one already. <laughs> Wait, no, it wasn't. That was eight out of nine. Okay, I always see eight out of nine, I think it's gonna go up, you know, because that's usually what most games do when you have like a platformer that has like collectibles like this. It's like, oh, hey, here's the counter. Okay, now it's gonna go up. But no, it's like it already shows you what you got. Okay, so, so far so good. He ain't freaking out about nothing, so I'm gonna, you know, leave him be. Can you leave me alone though? One, two, three. Get up like that, that was awesome. See, I'm just gonna try to coast through this level as much as I can until he starts uh, freaking out about stuff. Can I get on top of that owl? Not quite. One, two, three. For just doing three simple jumps though, you do get, you know, the banana token, so that's always worth doing. I mean, I have so many of these things, like I don't know how much you're supposed to have the banana tokens, because we have a lot right now. Uh, go ahead and get that extra life. But yeah, I, like, I don't know if it's really beneficial to have this many, but I certainly do. Okay, so I don't wanna bore you guys too much with this. If we don't find the puzzle piece pretty soon, I might just go ahead and you know keep going until we do get it, because I'm pretty sure we've done all of this. So yeah, <laughs> I then wanna go ahead and be right back until we get it. Oh, he's freaking out about something now. Uh, oh, maybe, did we? What is this? Okay, first off, pull this up. Really? Hold on. Why did we never get this one? Wasn't that one just clear as day? Weird, uh, yeah, and I died a lot of this area. I'm surprised I never noticed that. Weird. All right, well, there's all nine of them, right? All nine of them, okay, well, I'm gonna just go ahead and finish this level. All right, so there is all nine of those wonderful, wonderful puzzle pieces, which of course means we get an image unlocked. And so far we've done a fantastic job. Every level we've gone through so far, we've gotten all the Kong letters for. So if we could continue that trend going through the secret exits, we should be able to get the extra level pretty easily. But now we're gonna go ahead and I actually think I need to buy another set of uh, squawks, which is fine with me because I have a lot of coins. Once again, I don't know like how valuable these things are if I have almost 400 of them already and we're still trying to finish up World 2. So I think it's okay if I buy like five of them right now. Just buy a little stock of them, that way I don't want the console to be coming back. Um, then we're gonna exit the shop. Hurry up, bro, the surf out there is looking excellent. I'll keep that in mind, Funky. Keep that in mind. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna go back to World 2-2, Mountain Mania, and our goal is to find multiple things. Um, first off, of course, the puzzle pieces. Beyond that, we're trying to find a secret exit, which I actually, I might know where it is. I remember there being a pit. And I was like, that's sort of a weird looking pit, but at the same time, that just sort of also looks like a pit of death. So maybe that's it, maybe it's not. I definitely know where the other secret exit is, or at least what may be the secret exit. There were a couple secrets. Like I found, like it was in the minecart level. Oh, this is, okay, yeah, that's right. This is the uh, Rambi level, which may be a bit tough. Uh, it was definitely tough the first time around. But we're just gonna go ahead and try to just pay attention to everything. Rambi is right here, so. Hey, Rambi. I honestly thought that we were gonna get Rambi more than what we ended up doing um, in this game so far when it comes to Animal Friends. But yeah, I'm just gonna try to run around 
Look for what we can. I've already done this, this is gonna be a banana token thing. Okay. What if I just fell? Because I've already... What? I didn't mean to do that. Whoops. I mean, he sort of got excited for a moment, which is making me concerned. Was that one of them? Uh... I don't think so, because usually when he gets excited about a, a token, I think it was just because he just popped up. Was this one? No. Because I know we didn't break the bell on that one. Anyways, maybe for now we can just keep moving until we end up, I definitely got that one, that's for sure. We're just gonna keep moving as quickly as we can until Squawks gets excited, because for right now, I don't think he's gonna. We'll have to wait and see. So I don't need that Rambi, that's for sure. So if he's not excited, I'm not interested. So that's what I'm waiting for, oh boy. Moving platforms. So far it's going pretty well though, like he's not freaking out, like how many are we missing? Just one, just one. Man, I don't really know where that is. I'm also trying to keep my eyes peeled, of course, for any other secrets, because I'm still looking for that secret exit. In a perfect world, hopefully we'll be able to find the puzzle piece and the secret exit in one go, but I have a feeling that maybe the secret exit is before the final puzzle piece, so we'll have to really look. This is where the, the area got a little difficult. I mean, at the same time, didn't it look weird how there was like a platform? I always thought that it was weird that there was a platform there, but it doesn't really seem like it is much. Like, maybe there's a way to get back there without the, thing exploding, but I don't think that's the case. It's weird how it works. See, like, there's like a little platform there with spikes on it, but then all of a sudden it just falls and there's like nothing you can do about that. It's just weird how it's like, why is that there in the first place then? Why did they add that? I don't know. Anyways, uh, doesn't seem like Squawks has been too interested. I mean, it's hard to really pay attention to when situations like this. Yikes. <laughs> These platforming sections are still tough with Rampy. They, they'd not get any easier. See, I guess when, uh, Squawks first shows up, he sort of flaps downwards, like, hello. He does a little hello. Um, so I'm guessing that's what uh, what I saw when we went into that little bonus area, because I'm almost positive we already got that one done. Anyways, my main goal is just to get through this in one piece and pay attention to Squawks and any potential secret exits. Uh, so charge through you, and you, and all of your friends. There's lots of rodents around here, for one reason or another. Ow, no, Rambi, come on. Whoa, whoa, what are you freaking out about? Come on, this is not a good time. <laughs> Where is there a puzzle piece around there, dude? Hello. Okay, so apparently there's a puzzle piece between those maybe swinging platforms or something. Ah, this area is so tough enough without having to worry about that stuff. Jeez. Okay, cool. Jump, at least I'm getting a little bit better with it. Now that I know, of course, I need to tap the button instead of uh, holding it. Like, that definitely helps. I think it's still silly that it works that way. Okay, so where is the puzzle piece then? Like, he is really excited. He's like, you are there. Oh, uh, oh gosh, it felt. <laughs> where is it? I don't understand. Come on, you can't give me any more details than that, Squawks? Oh, um, I guess I got all the banana coins and bananas on top of the platform. I hadn't done that before? Okay, well, that was the only puzzle piece we're missing, right? It is, so I'm gonna try looking around some more and see if I can't find that secret exit, but at this point, I don't know. Where could it be? I looked for the life of me through that level for the secret exit. I can't find it anywhere, so maybe we can worry about it in a little bit. I'm gonna keep moving on to two, three horn top hop, where we're missing some puzzle pieces. I don't know how many, but we're gonna find out together as we bring Squawks in. It doesn't seem like I've missed too many throughout this world. Like It seems like each level I only miss one or two at most, so hopefully that trend continues here, and hopefully it's not too bad. Like The last level you know, was just getting the bananas at the right time, and I just gotta pay extra attention to that. Even in those chase scenes, I guess they they really do throw that at you sometimes. So let's see, how many am I missing right now? Two. Out of five though, that's quite a lot, you know? So I'll be looking for them, all right. I mean, I feel like with some of these, I, I think I know where one of them was. Obviously I played a couple days ago, so it's hard for me to remember, but I think that there was one where like I actually did find out where it was. It was just a matter of uh, I was like I had Cranky Kong or something, and that didn't really help me. Oh, it's the level with all these things. Okay, well. I'll do what I can about it, but at the same time, I'm just gonna try to make my way through. Okay, just pay attention to squawks, and beyond that, whoa, be careful. I was the opposite of careful. Can you not shoot fireballs at me? We definitely got what was up here. Yep, another puzzle piece. Okay, plop on your head. Okay, nice, nice, okay. 
We're doing all right so far. I don't see him freaking out. I mean, he does make some noises as well, it's just the noises aren't so noticeable. Oh gosh, oh gosh. So yeah, the round two I feel like is where I messed up. Because I remember I got that, um, what's it called? The uh, Cranky Kong Barrel right there, and then I ended up going into like a little secret area, so I just have to pay attention now, try to remember. Get some of these things. Okay, can I land on you? Yes, I can. Oh, he's getting really excited. Oh, oh. Yeah, it was right here. So, last time I did this one, I messed up miserably. So let's see if I can avoid doing that this time. All right. Got this one so far so good, actually. Uh, whoa. Okay, got it. Up on this platform, pick up all these bananas. Okay, so far, we're good. And then, there you go. You know, you think that if Donkey Kong just sold all the bananas he got, he'd probably be able to buy back his island and then some. <laughs> he'd be able to buy a lot of bananas with the money he would make selling bananas, right? <laughs> That'd probably be a bit convoluted, but it's not something I would expect Donkey Kong not to do. He seems a bit silly. Okay, so I made this guy dizzy, which is pretty cool. Can I hit him from behind and take him out? That damages him. Yeah, I don't understand what's up with this dude. He's sort of like pretty tough. Why is he so strong? I mean, you can take him out, it just takes a lot of effort. I probably shouldn't have gone through. Anyways, we're looking for one more puzzle piece in this level, which actually shouldn't be too bad. I gotta be careful about this, because it will end up, ow, making us lose Dixie Kong. Oh no, and Donkey Kong. Went a little too fast there, that's for sure. Ooh, we're over 90 lives though, which is pretty good. Did not realize that. Like, I really hope this is the kind of game that will let you go above 100, because I feel like later in the game, it's gonna get so difficult that I'm probably going to lose a lot of lives. I honestly am expecting it with, a lot of people say this game is difficult, you know? Okay, uh, I heard a noise as if something popped up over this way, but at the same time, if Squawks isn't excited about it, neither am I. Okay, one, two, and three. Grab onto the thing there, I did a pretty good job with that. I'm gonna try to grab onto the grass over there. We did a pretty good job with that as well. So I'm gonna try to get, Okay, wait, not Cranky, I'm sorry Cranky, you're, you're a great dude. But a lot of the times it seems like the situation is better for the other Kongs, and this is one of those situations. I'm gonna keep going up if I can. I don't think there's anything over there. All right then, getting rid of you. Okay, this is definitely not going to be a puzzle piece we haven't already gotten. There's gonna be more bananas actually, nothing too exciting. I just gotta pay attention to that bird. I mean, he's so helpful, I wish, I mean, maybe he does. But I really hope that Squawk shows up as an actual playable animal friend like Rambi in this game. And I don't think that you had that in uh, DKC Returns. I think it was only Rambi that was an animal friend, which stinks, because if you compare that to the original Donkey Kong games, or the Donkey Kong Country games, you had so many different friend things, either it be the, uh, like the frog or, wait a minute. Oh yeah, so I remember this now. It has to be somewhere on this incline then. Where exactly, uh, we'll find out. Okay, so he's really excited. How much you want to bet it's just getting all these bananas? Yes, it was. I gotta stop doing that. I gotta make sure that if there's a lot of bananas around, I get all of the bananas, because there's so many secrets that seem to be tied to that, which I wouldn't expect, you know, especially being used to something like Mario. Um, is like, usually in Mario games, it does, like the star coins are the star coins, so their own entity. Getting all of these won't give you a star coin, you know? So, but in Donkey Kong, that's much different. There's lots of things that can activate secrets. Anyways, we got it all done. That's all of the puzzle pieces, right? Yep, so we are good to get out of here. We got some extra bananas, which is pretty good to me. Okay, so yep, there's five out of five for those, which means we got another image unlocked. We can move on to the next level, which is going to be, I think, the minecart level, right? Uh, Sawmill Thrill, yes it is. So I do know where the majority of what I'm missing is, but it might not hurt to get him out here, especially with how many of these coins we get per level. We always get more than five a level. Unless I'm like really, really rushing through it or it's a boss fight, we get like at least like 10, 15, 20 tokens level. That's why we have nearly 400 of them already. Okie doke, so let's see. We're missing two of them. I know they're both on the rails because you know it doesn't really let you go too far before it's, you know, you're on the rails. And I know they're pretty late on. Like, I think both of them, I know where they are for the most part. I just need to make the right jump at the right time. Because if I mess it up, then I usually get hit by a checkpoint, and that's why I couldn't get them before. Okay, can duck under this. Well, gosh darn, what a fun level. Like, a really, really fun level. The 
The minecart levels, which were already great in the original DKC games. I was I was pressing the duck button, that was weird. Um, I'm getting all kinds of hurt right now, I need some more hearts. Uh, okay. <laughs> but they're even better in this game when you're not awful at them like me. This is where I gotta start being careful because they really could be anywhere. So far, so good, but I think we're really getting close to some of them. Whoop. Oh gosh, that was scary. Yeah, this is where there's a whole bunch of like, okay, he's getting really excited about something because it's under there. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, look at this. Huh. There's a little area like this in the middle of all the action. This might be really tough though because I do not have a Kong friend. Might not actually be very possible for me. I'm sort of wildly going for the bananas though, which is probably not the best thing I should be doing at the moment. Oh gosh. Oh gosh, I have 18 seconds left. Um, That's sort of a good chunk of time. Oh gosh. Okay, I got him, nice, not bad. Without any Kong friends, that's quite a challenge to achieve. Okay, so there's that done, but we're still missing one more. I don't, right? Yeah, yeah, and I don't know where that is, so I have to be extra extra, extra careful. Okay, we're going back into the, the sawmill thing. I don't know how that doesn't turn a Donkey Kong into something not so pretty, but maybe he's just that strong. Maybe I don't give him enough credit. Okay, so, oh gosh, this is where things get weird. Luckily, they do give you like a health refill for going into that bonus area. Okay, okay, whoa, there it was. Okay, so might as well take one last hit if I can and try that again. That one's actually pretty easy. I'm surprised I missed that one. I was probably just still going with the flow. I know, hello, squawks. But uh, I just have to hop on the right platform at the right time, which usually isn't too bad. Okay, got it. And we're gonna get it this time. I'm gonna jump over that, and then I need to jump on that, jump on this, jump over like that, jump, jump, and then jump. There we go. It's a toughie for sure, but we made it. So I'm only looking for one more thing, and it's the secret exit, and I'm pretty sure I know where it is. Oh, this part's so cool. Um, I think that, yeah, here, I need to just fall instead of a, oh gosh, I should not have jumped like I did. <laughs> I was trying to hold the button so that, I think, yeah, you have to land on that little bird you might have seen down there. You land on the bird, you, you probably need to get a good jump from it, so I wanted to hold down A, but I pulled, held it down too soon and jumped to my doom. But there is certainly the secret exit down there for at least uh, roll 2B. Ow, forgot about that. I'm still a little close for 2A, but maybe we'll figure it out as we go along. Okay, guess there was no point in taking that high road again. Getting a couple more tokens out, which is great. Okay, so. Survive this for lot, really, seriously? <laughs> that is just silly. Okay, oh gosh, finally. That took me way more attempts than I'm willing to admit. That's a very tough jump to make, but I guess there's a way up to the normal exit just in case you wanted to take that instead. But very cool, we find ourselves the secret exit, and I get the DK, cool, 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 cool. All right, we get 12 tokens for that, which is awesome, awesome stuff. And uh, yeah, the two puzzle pieces, secret exit, everything's looking good in the world now. I still have to find the first secret exit, but uh, that's fine. I at least made that work. That was so tough for me to get to, that final big jump. Okay, so this is level 2A. Oh, no, wait, this is level 2A. I guess maybe there's a secret exit to here that leads down for whatever reason. That's a bizarre choice. 2A Crumble Cavern, we could go to that, but I feel like we'll save the uh, secret levels for a little bit from now. Um, I just wanna make sure we've gotten, oh yeah, we have gotten all this, all the puzzle pieces and stuff. Well, look at me, very fancy. So we can just go ahead and do 2A. So is there 2A, 2B, and 2C? I suppose so, I didn't really think about it before. And we're just gonna play, we're not gonna go ahead and equip squawks or anything until we complete the level once normally. But yeah, we will be doing some new stuff today. We aren't just keeping it with the levels we already completed. I wanna check out 2A, 2B, and whatever else might, there might be. So this is Crumble Cavern, and it certainly is a cavern. Look at this place, it's beautiful. Look at those mushrooms and everything. Okay, I'm excited to explore this. I mean, we've had uh, cavern levels or just like cave levels in general in other Donkey Kong games, the first one, definitely. Okay, this is so cool. This is one heck of a cool level so far. So I don't see anything to the left or downwards. I do see this barrel. I don't know what I'm gonna need it for, so I'm trying to be careful with it, because I almost always need them, right? Uh, but so far, that's not looking to be the case. Um. I'm gonna go a little bit further. Oh, they have cheese. All right then. Um, I do see that K level or K letter. 
I'll keep that in mind in a moment. For now, I'll let the water push this platform back up, and we'll go up here. This is so cool, I really like this level so far. There's our first puzzle piece, first of seven. So we got a lot of uh, work ahead of us, that's for sure. I'm just like really, really digging this game. I honestly feel bad that I missed out on it a couple years back on release on the Wii U. I mean, I feel like now is a good time to get into it because I feel like honestly, oh gosh, there's more people interested in the game now than when it released on the Wii U, which is a shame to say, but I mean, I don't think it's the fault of the people who made the game. I just think it was that uh, the game just wasn't very popular. So I did see this uh, barrel down here. I just wanted to see if there's anything I could throw that guy at. Okay, got another one of these. Last time we did this, we didn't have a Kong friend and we did okay. What about this time? I mean, it's weird that it hasn't given us a Kong friend yet, but hopefully soon it does. It has a change of heart. Uh, so I gotta be careful about that. 20 seconds left to get the rest of these. Uh, I don't know how much I trust that. Oh no! Gosh darn it. Some people were saying, I don't know if uh, it's true. What if I, oh the barrel's not even there anymore. They don't even give you another chance. I wanna just try dying and see if the barrel pops back up, especially since it resets me at the very beginning of the level. Maybe that would be an easier way. Uh, can you help me out? Boom, getting that, thank you. Okay, so I've earned back my life pretty easily enough. And then once I get the coin, I can hop off of this thing, just like that. Okay, so this barrel, for whatever reason, it just doesn't do much. I guess it's there to get rid of you know the guy with the, the horned helmet, but beyond that, not really giving me much there. Whoa, buddy, stop that. Okay, I can get up here though. Ooh, the barrel's back. Nice, so it does give me another chance. Because we died before a checkpoint, I can only assume. Uh, it's like I started the level fresh, which is really generous. Gotta keep that in mind. Um, if we haven't gotten to the checkpoint, just start the level over. It's really tough to do without a Kong friend though. It might just be something I come back once we have a Kong friend, because that is just not easy for me to do. If we die naturally, I'll go ahead and do it again. These bananas are certainly gonna give me something, and hey, look, there is a, uh, something to throw an enemy at. So, where is this dude? I'm gonna grab you real quick, and then pick you up, and get you over this way. I don't know what this is gonna be. A puzzle piece, pretty easy, pretty easy. Okay. So yeah, oh gosh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> a little scary, gotta be honest. I'm guessing I could get, I have to be able to get something for getting these bananas. Just don't go into the, uh, the death one yet. Okay, there it is. Yep, caught it. Uh, it's, it's difficult to get, that's for sure. Got it, okay. Okay, we're making our way through. <laughs> these cannons I have no control over. Whenever the ones with the skull and crossbones, they shoot them, shoot me out automatically. So here's finally Diddy Kong or Dixie Kong. I'm definitely gonna take Dixie. She really is by far the best Kong companion. It's great. These look old and moldy, and I'm guessing that means they will fall, and that definitely seems to be what's happening. Gotta be careful about those. So this one's just a normal one, as you can see. But the other ones, uh, you, you turn on fire, so I'd rather not try to land on you. Fire owls are not in my interest at the moment, gotta be honest. Okay, what is this gonna get me? Probably not much, but it is another Kong coin. I, I have well over 400 of them now. So where is this gonna lead me? Up or down? I think I'm gonna go down for the extra life. Whoa. Why would I wanna go down that barrel instead of the other one? I mean, I guess I don't have much of a choice, do I? Okay. Uh. Don't have much of a choice there. I was gonna send me to my doom, it looked like. Or maybe not. That was weird. It looked like maybe there was another option there. I am very concerned now. Get rid of this pagman. I mean, I gotta go back through the level anyways, you know, with a conga pen to get that one extra bit anyways, so. Doesn't really matter too much. Oh gosh, that was a scary jump. Why'd I do that? I cannot lose my Kong friend. If that's gonna be my goal, is to come back with it. I'm definitely gonna try to get all these bananas as much as I can. No, why am I so bad at this? Come on. I mean, once again, it's not the biggest deal if I plan on replaying the level, but ugh. Oh gosh, these are all falling. Uh, That's not good, I gotta start moving then. I mean, I've gotten an okay amount. Oh, how much you wanna bet there was something up there? Whoa, uh, hold on, this is weird. How could I have gone to that Kong letter situation there? Things were moving a little bit too quickly for me to really comprehend what happened. This barrel is all over the place. What is with magical barrels in Donkey Kong, Kong land? Come on, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? No, go back. 
Go back right now. I am not done with you. Uh, is it even possible to hit all of them? Like, it doesn't seem like it is. Cause like, I'm tapping A as quickly as I possibly can. Okay, at least get the Kong coin or the banana coin. Is it gonna be a puzzle piece? No. Uh, that's gonna be triple. That's pretty cool. And that's the end of the level. And it does not let you go back. That is total baloney. So there's definitely some stuff I missed out on there. We're gonna try to go ahead and get it again. As you can see, I just got the K and the O and only four out of the seven puzzle pieces. We really missed out on a couple things. I already know where five is. You know, the fifth one. I missed out on six and seven though. So that's gonna lead me down that way, which is to be rodent ruckus. So what is down that way? It's still a mystery. I mean, I just don't know if this unlocks it or not. Like I wouldn't think that there be a secret exit here that goes down there, but at this point I don't really know. Anyways, 2A Crumble Cavern. We're gonna go ahead and I guess get squawks. I mean, makes you invincible for five hits, adds an extra heart level, uh, protects vehicles from damage, three uses, or fills your air meter, saves you from falling most of the time, three uses. Weird. I would really like maybe something that like attracts bananas. That way some of those other uh, puzzle pieces that like you have to just collect all the bananas, which I feel like is sometimes a silly concept depending. Um, Kong Sept, uh-huh, Donkey Kong Sept. That's, that's a silly joke, Zebra. But um, yeah, it would be cool if there was a, uh, a power-up that does that, that way those are easier to get. Anyways, Squawks is gonna tell me all about the ones I missed, hopefully. Hopefully he's interested in that. I should probably grab onto that vine, or awful things happen. Okay, got it, cool stuff. Don't think I'm gonna need you too much. But yeah, it was, I already got the one up there. So I can worry about just making our way out this way and then plopping on, excuse me? Was that the wrong one? Also we had 99 lives. Oh boy, I gotta go get a Kong friend. Or I can just try it again. Maybe I should just go ahead and try it. Like maybe that's just a problem, is that I'm just gotta get better at the game. So yeah, I don't know if we can break 99 lives. It's looking like I can't. Cause I'm pretty sure that I, I wasn't just happened to be at 99. I, I guess that wasn't the spot with the barrel. I guess it was over this way more. Yep, I'm a dingus. Okay, let's try it again. I think I can get it though. I've learned enough from my mistakes, right? Absolutely not. I never stop learning from my mistakes. Cause I never stop making mistakes. Gosh darn it, Donkey Kong. You move in the air like you're several hundred pounds of monkey. Maybe cause you are. All right, there we go. Jeez, that took me way too many tries. But I guess it's the way you're supposed to do it, you know, unless you go into this level with a Kong friend and aren't awful like me and are able just to keep it around. Okay then, so we're just having Squawks help us find the rest of it. I mean, most of it, I sort of know to an extent. I mean, we already got this one, so we don't have to worry about that. I don't know why I am. But we're also missing the two Kong letters. Like, geez Louise, this is a difficult level. I mean, I know where the Kong levels are for this one as well, it's just, or at least, yeah, I do, I do. Cause it was the one that I totally missed from the one barrel and the one I totally missed from the other barrel. So I'm just gonna have to hope that Squawks is really noticeable for most of this because I'm sort of on the move constantly uh, because of all these falling vines and stuff, which is no good. Okay, got in, I get another free token, which is nice. Is there anywhere else to go? Doesn't look like it to me, so we're just gonna shoot ourselves through and maybe I wanna to go to the upper path this time, because I feel like I totally missed something by... Oh, I see that. So what is this then? This is another secret one, okay. Awesome. All right, now hello, Squawks. Get up like that, try to get this bushel on the very top. Very good. Okay. Try not to roll jump too much, because I feel like it uh, can always be a risk. Okay, that was actually done really well. Get this last one, and boom! Not a problemo there. That one was first try. Awesome. Okay, so now all we're looking for is one more, right? Yes, one more. So going up there was the correct choice by far. And we're just gonna look for one more, which I'm pretty sure I know where it is, but at the same time, I'm not entirely sure. Okay, wait, get rid of you. I was trying just to get away from that guy. So we already know of a puzzle piece that was to the left there, but we already got it. Okay, he's getting excited, which means this is definitely where it's supposed to be. 
That one that's really close to the, the barrel of doom is the one I'm worried about. It's so difficult. Oh, this is not easy to time. There we go, got those. Gosh darn it. Come on. Give me a hand here, DK. Come on, no. And get him. No! How, how much closer can I get? Okay, there we go. Seven out of seven for those. But we're still missing the two cog letters where I know where both of them are technically. Getting to them, though, is a different story. Um. Got it. Got it. Got it. And then, like, this one doesn't fall. But maybe this isn't. Oh, I get it. You can wait for that to fall. Okay. So I know where the last one is. Oh boy, we just gotta make it there. We just gotta make it there. Okay, so a bunch of stuff pops up just like that, and yep, got it. So there are all the letters, which is fantastic. Now we can get some extra lives if we wanted to. I'm gonna mostly just focus on the Kong coins, but if I can get some extra stuff like that too, it's great. Okay, whoop, got it. Okay, that hit me for <laughs> no good reason, but that means this level is Totally complete, which is really, really good. And then, okay, I didn't get hit there. Awesome. So let's see if we can't get, nope, can't get the DK, because I'm awful at timing things. All right, so we got everything there, image unlocked, everything's perfect. Let us keep moving. We got one B, so we're, or two B. So we're doing the things in the correct order. Maybe, that's, maybe that down there is the K level. But then what is that up there? I figured that little birdhouse was the K level. All right, well for right now we'll do two B rodent ruckus. Seems like it could be a good time. Or it could be a ruckus. I'm, I'm, I guess I'm sort of leaning towards that, that latter option. Okay, so we seem to be in like another cave. DK and Dixie. Nothing that way. I always gotta check to the left first in this game or any kind of game like this. So I, of course, immediately see something here and it's already a secret little area. Well, this is why I'm glad I have Dixie around. Okay, whoop. This one actually might be doable just with Donkey Kong. But I'm glad I have some extra help because it doesn't hurt. Uh, we're getting really close to it, but I wanna wait for these platforms to get a little closer to me Okay, and just land on it. Awesome, we did it. There we go, another puzzle piece for us. Cool stuff, so we can just go up like that, yep. There's nothing on this side. <laughs> Not looking like it. Feel bad for DK sometimes, I just sort of roll them into things. What is with this barrel? Uh, whoa, whoa, wait a minute. Is this what I think it is? Oh, do I have to tap that? Yes, I do. <laughs> All right, whoa, 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 hold on. We're about to crash to our doom there. Didn't know what I was doing, so if you hold down A, you go up, and if you let go of A, you just sort of slowly descend down. Oh, gosh, cheese, cheese everywhere. Get that letter K. You know what, let's retry this. <laughs> Jeez Louise, that is weird. I don't remember doing this in the original Monkey Kong Country Returns. It is weird. Oh, now I don't have my Kong friend. That's not good. Ow, hit the wall up there. Okay, so let's try this again. I mean, it doesn't, I guess it doesn't really matter because you still are only limited to three health. This is so cool, but also so weird. Okay, gotta be careful, gotta be careful. Oh man, I missed it again. No, I gotta get this calling letter. That is not easy to get to. Okay, follow it, nice. Okay, we actually did really well there. I'm trying to just follow the bananas or whatever opening I can see, because usually when there's a click, wait, I just missed a puzzle piece by following, I was just going to say. You know, like, oh, as long as you follow the collectibles, everything should turn out okay. Unless you follow the wrong collectible, and then you'll miss out on a puzzle piece. Gosh darn it, Donkey Kong. I don't blame you for it, but I also, I just need somebody to be mad at right now. Okay, it's more obvious than ever than what I gotta do here. And it's like, if I don't do it now, I gotta come back, so might as well, you know, just reset it. But it definitely it's like 99 lives is the cap. So far, I've been doing an okay job at keeping up with that, though, so I'm not gonna complain. It'd be cool to see how many lives I could actually end up getting if it stayed above 99. Uh, so go under that one, but go above that one. I feel like there's like no way to really telegraph that one. You just sort of have to know, which is sort of silly. I'm trying to pay a lot of attention to everything with the letter O. They really like their cheese. I can't blame them. Jesus, those just, oh gosh, what's with the creepy eyes? Uh, you know what, forget I asked. What is with the spotlights? That probably could have been something right there too. Um, oh gosh, whoa, whoa, wait, hold on. I'm like losing grasp of the controls. Get that letter N, oh, but I fell too far. <laughs> I sort of made him do a nosedive. Oh gosh, let's try to get all those bananas down. 
Man, it's not easy. Come on now, DK, we can do it. Right? No, dude, really? I know that's gonna be like something. I feel like I need to do it again. Because we've got five puzzle pieces to find in this level. I've already only gotten two, so I'm looking for three more. That has to be one of them. Like, I don't know how long this is gonna be. Come on, come on. Ah, it's so difficult. Okay, I'm gonna keep going and just hope I'm wrong. But it doesn't seem like it is. Look at these guys excavating for cheese. All right, I got that one. I get these ones up there. There's a puzzle piece. Gosh darn it, Donkey Kong! I don't like the turbulence on this thing. It's not what turbulence is, but it's not easy to control because you can't, you're not really telling it to go down. You're just really telling it to no longer go up. And that's like a huge difference. And it's just not easy to control. Like it's it's a cool concept. Once again, a concept. But it's just not easy in any stretch of the imagination. Just keep going like that. Oh my gosh, and you gotta do it like just right. The curvature of it is bizarrely specific. It's not like your average shoot 'em up where it's just like, okay, just move the ship down here. That is so weird. Like I'm trying my best, okay? I promise. <laughs> it's so difficult. It's like one of those things that probably looks really, really easy, but it's just like suspiciously difficult. All right, well, I'm gonna try to just, got it. Okay, so three out of five now. Oh yeah, that's right, I can't land on the ground. I was like, okay, maybe I can run on the ground and just get a new one, restore our hearts a little bit, but that's not how it works. Okay, so I gotta be careful of this gigantic cheese wheel that we're dealing with now, and cheese falling from the sky. I mean, I was trying to move as far right as I possibly could. Maybe there's like a speed boost button? I don't wanna hear about my good effort. I'm putting in a better one. Okay, but yeah, maybe there is a speed boost button I'm not really clear on. It doesn't look like it, because I'm like pressing different buttons. They, they all just sort of, <laughs> they all just sort of bring me upwards or do nothing like that one did. Okay, my experimentation's over. Just try to survive the level. But I have to imagine that some of those rows of bananas that I just were struggling to get had to hold a puzzle piece of some sort. You know, it was pretty close to the other one, so maybe not if I'm lucky. Oh gosh, dodge that. I'm still looking for the letter N, I think. Maybe just letter G. Okay, gonna get this heart. Or did I miss the heart? I think I did. So I'm not getting that heart. Oh geez, whoa. I feel like I'm moving too quick for this. That is so weird, I feel like I'm moving too quickly. Maybe holding around the D-pad is doing something. That is so weird. I don't wanna try that again. I mean, I'm moving like left around the D-pad. It doesn't look like it has an effect. You just have to be like perfectly in the right position. I mean, leave it to this game to make a fun little flying section ridiculously difficult, but uh, it's okay. It isn't too bad so far. I just gotta keep moving and surviving. Ow, I just totally took that cheese slice in the face. Okay, go under that one, cause sure, why not? But yeah, you're just supposed to really know what you're doing with it, but it's so weird. It's such a tight little thing to, to make work. Come on, oh gosh, it's really catching up now. I'm getting that letter G. You can't stop me. Okay, this is a little concerning because I think we're, oh, maybe we're not at the end. Oh no, we're at the end. <laughs> okay, oh gosh, we're out of juice, we're out of juice, we're out of juice. Oh no, okay, we made it. Oh, hold on, hold on. Big jump over to this way, so we are missing a puzzle piece. I'm almost positive I know where it is. Can't really get it now, but there we go. We got that level, and that was fun. That's a really cool concept. I keep on using that word over and over again today. Uh, I, I, I obviously that was a Donkey Kong Country return, just cool to see it make another return. I mean, I guess it's not another return which showed up for the first time. So where does this lead? Up there. And hey, look at that, that is the level K level, okay. Huh, I've been led astray. See, so yeah, like this, that, that little bird thing, it isn't anything. <laughs> I thought it was like sort of leading over there as if it was a secret. All right then. Just to be extra careful, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, hop into this level, but we're also gonna equip squawks, because we have a couple of them. We have two of them left, so that should be good. Let's head back into this level, I'm gonna get that last puzzle piece. Okay, squawks is getting excited, 100% it's this. Come on, yeah, first try this time, awesome! So there's all five of the puzzle pieces, no problemo. Definitely second time through, I'm having a much easier time with this. I don't know what I like, you know, like figured out. I just feel like I'm just getting better at controlling it. I missed out on that puzzle piece, but I already got it, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so I'm gonna finish this level up, and then I guess we'll do the magical secret K level. 
All right, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and go down this way. We got everything else done. If I check the summary before we finish up with that last level, we've gotten everything except for the time trials. Now time to move on to 2K, which is Bopopolis? Bopopolis? I don't know. We're gonna try it out. Of course, 1K, World 1K, was very, very fun. So I'm excited for this one. Hopefully it is just as good. We're gonna find out together. Uh, but it's loading for now. But yeah, I had a lot of fun with that level, even though it was a little difficult, but it was still fun to try. Okay, so, here's DK. And it's another one of these temples. It seems like all of these sort of like secret levels are always these temples. Oh my. Uh, whoa. Well, that was a little weird. I'm gonna assume that I'm gonna have to get all of these bananas, so I'm trying to get to it. One, two, and three. I'm getting lots of, uh, coins. Okay. This is fun so far. A lot of combo jumps, which is always really fun. Okay, okay, that's a problem. <laughs> I messed that jump up a little bit because these platforms, they fall after you land on them. So I've been trying to be a little bit hasty with that. Actually, did I ever check to the left? Well, I'm checking now. Okay, got it, awesome. And then this, of course, did give us the puzzle piece, but it's worth doing again. Two and three, got it, nice. Okay, so we're doing pretty good. We already did this part. Yeah, all I had to do was that, and then you have to roll jump off of that one. It's so much fun. Oh gosh, oh gosh, okay, so I got it though, I got it, that's a big thing. Awesome. So a lot of you are letting me know, apparently there is a way to just play as like Dixie Diddy and Cranky, and the way to do that is that you would have to play two player, but then just also just kill off Donkey Kong, which I'm pretty sure that's also how you would play like Luigi in some of the original Mario games. Uh, I don't plan on doing that just because I feel like it's a little extra work and Donkey Kong plays fine enough. Um, it'd be cool if we could just get some Kong friends for this level, I'm sure it'll eventually toss it at us. But uh, in the meantime, I'm having a good time with this. I think it'll be okay. Uh, let's go ahead and try to get rid of these guys. But yeah, luckily that counts as collected now, which is good. I don't see any others, so I think we're just fine to keep moving. Ooh, not bad right there. I mean, there wasn't too much more we could do. Whoa, wait, oh, I did that wrong. I thought that the, that was weird right there. So there was a puzzle piece under the platform if you didn't see. I thought that if we fell, the puzzle piece would remain where it was in place and we would just sort of fall past it and then I just had to get off the platform. Now we have to go under that platform. Yeah, we're gonna be seeing the beginning of this area quite a lot it seems because there likely are not, oh gosh, any checkpoints in this level just like the first one. Okay, okay, so. Uh, that's not how you're supposed to do it, but I got the puzzle piece. That's sort of the weird thing. How do you normally get that one? Maybe I could just jump from, like I don't know if that's a platform you can jump from under. Technically now I have it, which is great, but the problem is I don't know how to normally get it, which I guess doesn't matter too much. I am really bad at this game. So yeah, that uh, puzzle piece has been taken now, which is great. Uh, I just gotta be careful about all of this. Okay, so it's launching me all over the place. Bounce. Oh wait, 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 you little trickster! Where did you come from? Wait, how could I have done that? I guess maybe just a matter of timing. Oh, I just got here too. I wanna keep around for right now just because I know there's gonna be a pain in the butt to edit. But uh, I've been meaning to try to find some time to talk about some other stuff. A lot of you have sort of, you know, settled on what you would like to see me play when it comes to hard mode or easy mode. And it's like a lot of people seem like they don't mind as long as they don't play Funky Kong anymore. And I'm fine with that. Oh my gosh, never mind. Never mind, I'll be right back. Okay, so, I sort of remember this part, but yeah, a lot of people were just saying that the real easy mode is just playing as, oh gosh, that's not gonna work. Playing as Funky Kong. I am getting these in the most unorthodox way. That's probably gonna annoy a lot of people, but as long as I don't play Funky Kong, because these are the real easy mode, I'm having a lot of fun with what I've been doing, and I plan on just keeping it how it is, but I'm glad that you guys sort of seem to like, you know, agree with it now, which is good. But yeah, I definitely, at this point, we've been already, you know, trying so hard to get all of the things I do plan on continuing, oh, darn it, to get 100%, so. For those of you asking, please 100% it. Don't worry, I am. Okay, so I don't have to worry about that puzzle piece, however you're supposed to get it. But wow, we look at that. Okay, so I have to land on you. Uh, I definitely have to land on you and then do that, oh gosh, I'm so scared. Uh, okay, am I going the right way? I don't even know anymore. Oh, I definitely need to get you. Oh, oh, oh. Oh no, oh, it just keeps going, it never stops. Okay, I'm bouncing off of you. Okay, that's a pretty easy combo right there. Did, did what, what, what? what? 
no. It's so tough. Thank goodness we have all the puzzle pieces. Okay, I'm gonna just finish this level up then. Come on, come on. Okay, okay. Now the penguin part is tough. Bounce, bounce, I've never gotten this far. I always miss at the first penguin. I don't know where we're going. To this guy, okay, but I didn't have enough forward momentum to get to him. That is, it just doesn't make any sense to me. This. I've been spending almost an hour on this level now. The second half is just like, it's near impossible. It's ridiculously more difficult than anything we've gone through yet in the game. And I don't understand why. Like, it's crazy difficult. Like, it just does not let up, as you can tell. I've been on this level for a while because I think we only had like 400 banana tokens before. I have over 800 now. And that just sort of happens naturally from this level being total baloney, like maximum baloney. Like they were giving the baloney away for free because I just had too much of it. All right, there we go. I'm just gonna bring you guys along for the ride for this one. I've been sort of silently brooding, trying to complete this level. Since I've gotten all of the things that matter, I've just been, you know, hitting the guys I need to hit and then moving on with the rest of it. The thing is that some of these platforms, like this one, are very thin. And honestly, Donkey Kong doesn't work very well with thin platforms. Okay, okay, I somehow made that jump. Usually if you jump on it from that, Angle, you end up getting taken out. Like you'll just fall right past him. Okay, so not so bad that time. Oh, I always get so confused there. It's such sort of like a, a scary spot too. Come on, come on, those penguins are coming and they don't wait apparently. Got it, got it. Come on, keep moving, keep, wow, that is so weird. Like that part, like honestly does not make sense to me. I don't know what I'm missing there. Okay, okay, we're doing all right. Uh, don't know what's next. I don't know what's next. Oh, okay. Uh, was that it? Oh my gosh, we did it. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm sorry if I sound a little exasperated, but that literally took me an hour. But we did it with all five puzzle pieces, image and diorama unlocked. Oh, I'm gonna cry. That was amazing. We finally did it. I would have gone back and gone like Diddy Kong or something, but then I would have had to re-get all of the puzzle pieces. Now it would have taken me even longer. So I was just like, okay, no, we're doing this as Donkey Kong. It's clearly how it's meant to be done. And I did it. We got all the puzzle pieces, which means 2K Bopopolis is done. We found a mysterious relic. All is good in the world. If we take a look at the menu in the summary, we got everything except for the time trials. I am very, very happy. And as you can see, it took me so long. I got 99 lives, 999 banana coins. So I am tired, but in the next episode, we'll be tackling the next world, which I'm super duper excited to check out because it's home sweet home. It's the bright Savannah. So I hope you guys are as excited about that as I am. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze. If you watched this video, make sure you comment Rambi Zebra. So now you've watched the end of the You Are A Zebra Task Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.